hi guys i'm back again today with another buy me a coffee request and this is uh kamal saleh chaos ali dawa um we'll find out how so before we just start don't forget to subscribe click the bell button and let's see what this is about excuse me things like clickbait yeah things like uh clickbaity titles mm -hmm. why do you do it what kind of clickbait title has he done? Oh, that looks good. Oh, uh, I think we're done with the gender. If he shines in Pakistan, and I'm here by myself, I have no one to do dining to gender anymore with. I wish some. Hello, he ah, I know you from YouTube. I know you from YouTube. Cup, 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 cup. Oh, Adam. <laughs> Come out. That's the other guy. Oh, Come out, Come out to this place. What's it called? It's called uh, Ejje Baba. Yeah. Assalamu alaikum, brothers and sisters. As you can see, we are inside here at Dining Tajanda with the one and only the champion, oh, undefeated, the, the featherweight. Um, I'm not talking about Mohammed Ajab, of course. I'm talking about. Uh, how do you know I was talking about myself? We know you. No, we're talking about the beautiful brother, brother Kamal Saleh. That's it, right? Kamal Saleh. Kamal Saleh. Mashallah, may Allah bless you. What's your first impressions? With the menu? Um, first thing, we can tell that it's a Turkish restaurant. So okay, mm -hmm. let's test you because we know, you know you've got Turkish links. Mm -hmm. How do you pronounce that letter there? Oh, well, that's a. How do you pronounce it? Ch. Okay. You know. Is it the. Chile. What makes it the ch, though? It's that little thing. Yeah, that the little thing. Yeah. Like, if there was that. Because my comment section told me how to pronounce uh, that because I pronounce it like C or S normally. I mean, S, I think, is the one that has that, right? And then. They were like, no, it's not like this. It's like, cha. And I'm like, thank you, my Turkish viewers. It would be a ja. Ja. If there was just a, a C, it would be like a ja. Brother. Yes. That's what you're, 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 you're the one with the link. Cut this bit out, please. Okay. So we ordered exactly at, let's get a specific timing here. There we go, one second. 5.05. Five. Oh, no, 5.08. Five, oh, oh, let's be yeah, just. Yeah. We have to be just. <laughs> we, don't be want just. To, we don't want to be a person there. <laughs> okay, so it's a pleasure to meet you. You too, You've come all the way from Australia. Alhamdulillah. Oh, really? I'm very happy. I've always wanted to meet you. Mm -hmm. uh, may Allah bless you, inshallah. So obviously, as you know, we've ordered our food and usually we go into some kind of a topic. Nice, yeah. Did you pick the topic? I would like to ask you. Okay, the documentary is coming out. I'll let you know. <laughs> totally forgot about that. Yeah. <laughs> I gave up on the documentary. Okay. I'm not even going to ask about that. I gave okay, up. Sorry. I think everyone gave up. I think if you are going to release it, it's it. going to be such a hit. I think it should go on Netflix. Because right now. Netflix gave me a million pounds, the, I want to put it on. The amount of hype you've Money. created around this Money documentary speaks. that is not even happening, according to me. If it happens, it happens. But you know what? That's good. You've submitted your And If it happens, yeah. it happens. If it doesn't, you only got nothing to lose. Look, if you do release it, please allow me to review it before it goes out. I'll give you my word. The moment the man then finishes episode one, okay. I'm going to send it to you. Yeah, look, the topic I wanted to ask you yeah. was um, a topic that I battle with as well. Okay. And that is um, being cringy. Okay. For the sake of the da'wah. And when yes. I say this, yes. it's, it's, it's a cute little topic that we can speak about. But at the same time, it's also like things like clickbait. Yeah. Things like uh, clickbaity titles. Why do you do it? Before I, get, so before I get into Okay, okay, so you want to you you go for the juggler vein? Yeah, yeah. that's what you're doing. <laughs> I for the uppercut. Yeah, no, yeah. Not even uppercut, that yeah. was a double uppercut. Pa, pa. Yeah. Okay, so very, you, know, you know what's very interesting mm. is I'm actually planning on doing because a whole I'm video. a social media guy, yes. well, like, I wanted to ask you. I see it like this, bro, yeah? Mm. Okay, one thing is, I, one thing that's very clear, like, which I can't do, I, I do not lie mm. in my clickbait. Mm. I made that very clear. Yeah. What you read is what you will get yeah. but it, in a different form mm. Mm. so the thing is here the reason i do that because at the end of the day bro let me be honest mm. sometimes this if you don't kill if you don't click wait um <clears throat> some it depends what kind of click you're doing right is it fake or is it real right it has to be obviously under the real but then clickbait. if you don't click what well, you're not marketing yourself firstly secondly um it's not gonna get out there and that is marketing to be honest like this shirt or sweater how did it like how did they market this of course maybe in the post or the magazine or wherever it was um they would be like very soft da -da -da -da, da -da -da -da. 
uh, sweater, buy it, and you will stay warm forever, or whatever the clickbait is. And it's true in a sense because it is soft, and then you will stay warm for reals, right? Even if you have nothing underneath, it's warm. Um, so it's like the truth, but then it's exaggerated truth is clickbait but some people do it but then when you watch the video there's nothing related to whatever they were like oh pink sweater with a heart and then when you watch it there's no sweater there's no pink pink there's no heart that is a different clickbait there's quotes that want to raise you or there's sometimes it's an important topic where i really really want people to like like i'm like people i want this to reach a mass amount of people yeah, yeah. now the thing is here some people are like oh are you doing it for views yes i am now the Stop. views yeah some people is like oh you just want to have views why do you post if you're not going to look for views what is the that those people they don't have brains sorry but those people they don't have brains like do you think i came to youtube to post to if I did, I would private it. If I didn't want anybody to see, I would private it. It's like, oh, you just want views. That's why you're reacting to this content. This is how they look like when they type those comments, to be honest. You just want to make views. Like, what is the point of you posting on YouTube if you're not going to want views? Like, it doesn't make any sort of logical sense, people. Like, check yourself. Like, before you start acting smart in the comment section is it actually smart or are you just talking shimenkos like those people irritate me like you think you're smart but you're just dumb you're just you sound dumb to be honest right like really oh you're reacting to this because you want views well first and foremost it was requested secondly well why do you post on youtube is it for views do you do you just post it because you're gonna watch it by yourself or you're you're just gonna post it for posting sake and what is like that comment is like the most stupidest thing i've ever heard in my entire existence to be honest <laughs> Myself, I don't need to do anything. I have to. I'm oh, sorry. That's so the thing is, here, when we're talking about views, it's in what perspective mm. does it come from? Yeah. Yeah. Bro, do I want, for example, the Prophet Sallam? Once a man came and he said, "Oh, Muhammad, be just." Yeah. And Omar al Khattab said, "Shut, get rid yeah. of this guy." Yeah. The Prophet Sallam said, "I don't want the people to say that the Prophet mm. Muhammad kills his people." Mm, mm, so what did he do? He he cared about how people perceived him. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. So, like, we're talking about how people, like, you know, viewed him. Mm -hmm. The point is, when it comes to this stuff, we want Islam and this specific topic, for example, if it's an issue pertaining to hijab, yeah, yeah I want the maximum amount of people to watch that. Yeah. So, I, number one is, I can't lie. Number two, it has to be pertaining. If it's, for example, an issue, I can't figure the top of my head, for example, if you think of any clickbait that I've done, yeah. you ask me. Any clickbait that I do, bro. If you can think of any yeah? clickbait, yeah, things is yeah, done. It will be very hard. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the thing is, bro, what I do is, I, my aim is to get people to watch that and benefit from that. Yeah. Does that mean that mm. I don't have intention problems sometimes? Mm. No, it doesn't. Yeah. All, of that, all that means is I'm using a strategy and I know some people get annoyed. And, and some people are like, you know what, I, I like it because it made me click. Yeah. And the title is not necessarily lie. Yeah. You've mentioned the truth, which mm -hmm. is the truth, mm -hmm. but it's not what I perceive it can be. Yeah. Now, if people are coming to watch it for drama and they were expecting drama and they're disappointed, unfollow me. So don't, don't, don't yeah. follow That's me. But if you're there where you know that every clickbait, show me one clickbait that I've done and there's not a Quran, Sunnah or a reminder, if I do clickbait for the sake of it, for example, yeah. oh, come and Saleh, punch my face and I get you to do a face, do a face, this and I do this. Yeah, and then the video was about Kamal Saleh didn't punch my face and we just was like, oh, it's a yeah. prank. I yeah. just wasted my time. But that was your thumbnail right there. Don't yeah, that's a good one. Actually, like, let's, let's, let's do another one. There you go. So the thing is here, it's these things yeah. because what they see and what they read, yeah? yeah. So my job is actually to use that. And I know mm. some people get annoyed and they've expressed their thing, like, like like concerns towards mm. it. But I know if I've done a video about somebody who needs, let's say, funds or raise funds for a person, who's, like sometimes, sadly, you don't click on it people who are dying in like we're doing charity causes yeah. you don't but when i go and do like uh, do it like we did a water project yeah yeah and i done a social experiment or something yeah. like i drink mud or something like that yeah 
and I don't yeah. know how to pour it, yeah? Yeah. Now, the thing is, I understand you might be upset. I wanted you to, I want to see Ali drink mud. Yeah. But actually, it's a bigger cause. Yeah, yeah. I mean, is it worth getting upset for? So I'm stuck in between where people think, oh, Ali's doing it for the money or this, mm. that. Look, Allah knows. Allah, yeah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows. I don't wake up, even when it comes yeah. to my content, bro. I'm not like, oh, let me look for content. Actually, if there's content, I do content. There is no content, I don't put no content. Yeah. I, you don't know how hard it is, bro, to go and find the content. It's this long, yeah. but it takes family time. Anyways, I'm gonna, I was gonna say something, but I'm gonna shut up because I'm just wasting my breath. Nobody's gonna listen anyways. Um, yeah, like nobody will understand unless they're in that position. We'll just leave it that way. Sometimes it, I'm with my family and I'm like, oh, this is such a deep topic and it needs to be covered because the issue is a hot topic. And you topic. need to give it its justice sometimes. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. So what, what about you? Yeah. You tell me. I mean, the way I see it is very similar to you. Like, sometimes I would have to admit that I do care about views. Yeah. But not for the sole reason of clout. Oh, look, I have those views it's behind awesome. my own. No, because sometimes views... Yeah. equates impact yes. or uh, views equates to impact yes. for instance if you get like a hundred thousand views yeah. that's a hundred yeah, like why would you like for example i watch this video and it gets only one view like why would i keep doing it if nobody's watching like what is the purpose of your existence on youtube platform is to just make a video for that one person and maybe accidentally it's just you who watched your video when it went up so you're just that one view like Commenters, think, 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 right? Stop using your fingertips and your mouth. Use your brain first. Like, that's what people don't, the people like those keyboard warriors, they don't think up before they start. This is your face. Thousand people that have heard the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. You know what that means, bro? Hadith 000. of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. One hundred thousand. You know what that means, bro? Yeah. If you think about it, bro, yeah. it's, it's mad. Thank you, sister. May Allah bless you. Let me help you there, inshallah. I can't wait for the food, though. Still, okay. So yeah, good. not compromising on yeah. the quality of your content. So compromise on the thumbnail. Okay. For the sake of uh, getting someone to click on it, because the nature of the beast, the nature of YouTube is, yeah. unless someone clicks on your video. Yeah you're not going to get any views. So if your thumbnail isn't clickbait friendly, <laughs> who's going to click on your video? So, so. Like, for example, this video, I will name mm -hmm. it, for example, uh, Kamal Saleh mm -hmm. confronts Ali about his clickbait. Ooh, yeah. Literally. You know what? And let me nice. tell you something. Was that not for, um, a form of yeah. confrontation? A form? <laughs> no, but I wanted Kamal Saleh to be like, oh, dang. The, you, 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 you want drama, bro? That's your problem. Yeah, you you want drama. Uh, exactly. Look, that's another point Go that you've actually brought up. Drama. YouTube rewards outrage. YouTube yes. rewards uh, anger, yes. a bit of polarization, a yes. bit of division. Yes. So at times we can feel pressure to succumb to that. YouTube has certain things to do. Uh, yeah, the guidelines they always say no violence blah, 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 but that's the ones that they push to the top it's like youtube are you okay and uh, i've seen and i don't know like <sighs> one of uh the videos that i reacted to recently was not recently but a while ago was is youtube racist and i i think so because there's a lot of people who post same videos as me but it doesn't get blocked but then i post it bye 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 that's why i have patreon because i cannot with youtube anymore as long as they're in the perimeters of the sharia and yeah. they're permissible yeah mm. other than that bro to be like oh but if i get, get bro believe me i can yeah. do some mad stuff to get me. the thing is bro i don't because you know why i do I have intention problems of course i think it was sophia yeah, who says i like completely yes. negate yes. any Naked of my public or women, things and because it's like literally <laughs> you're banking on something you've done in public which is exactly. very hard to say hey i was actually and, sincere in public. It's, uh, and bro you know what i learned from that bro wallahi mm. Is that, and this is how we need to be here. Yeah? There was a point in my life where, wallahi, bro, mm. I was thinking of leaving YouTube. I was very depressed. Imran, even went to Dawah, man. Yeah. He got me onto it, yeah? Like he said, you should do it, yeah? Yeah, so, so you never sought that. No, platform, no, no. Wallahi, bro, when you I went to Speaker's Corner, it, yeah. you know what I said to him? I said, brother, I like doing this. I don't want mm. it. Two of my videos you see was on the phone, yeah? 
mm. when I saw the benefits, so when I went back, I was like, oh no, no, I was doing it for the sake of Allah, because at the beginning, yeah. I wasn't after it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But then I'm like, hold on a second, as you carry on, I was like, well, hold on a second, I had an intention problem there, mm. and I had an intention problem there. So why I realized to myself is this, and this is the only way I got out of it. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, I was going to leave. Bro, I don't want to stand in front of Allah, and Allah says to me, you're a liar. It's yeah. the most scariest thing ever to a public figure, bro. Yeah. Another thing that helped me, mm throughout my journey. Yeah. The fact that you know Allah yeah. subhanahu wa ta'ala used me in one way or another through those spoken word videos and those poetry videos and yeah. on YouTube. Mashallah amazing. Right. I'm in the public eye. Yeah. So I realize that there's a second layer of accountability. Yes. There's the first layer of accountability that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sees me. Yes. But then there's the second layer of accountability uh, your community sees you. Yes. So if you stuff up I'm going to be accountable to Allah and then I'm going to be accountable to the community. Yes. And at times when we forget about Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and let's be honest, let's be real, there are times when we forget. Our Iman goes up, our Iman goes down. Sometimes it's very easy for us to forget. Yes. But then, you know, that, I have, that second layer of protection comes in. The community is going to see you. Yes. And it might be like hidden shirk or something, oh, are you scared yes. of the people, blah, blah, blah. We could talk about that. Yes. But the way I felt, it was like a protective mechanism. Mm. Social shame yeah. is a good thing to protect the person. Oh, I got scared for a second. I was like, what happened? I feel like this is the best restaurant they've been to. At least the restaurant I've had me too. Okay guys, so we are going to review inshallah. Oh, the finish up quickly. This is the review. I mean, obviously, uh, Firstly, we thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for giving us this food, brothers and sisters. Not only giving us this food. The ability to eat the, the food. The ability to taste and eat. Yeah, well. And for that food then to be good for you. It's a different story. Some mm. people, they, they can't eat certain foods. Even if they can eat, it's mm. not good for their stomach. Yeah. There are so many factors, mm. subhanAllah. So, let's get straight into inshallah. Okay, what spicy. stars would you give? the food Very. in general it's all so we're talking about i used to be able to eat them but as i get older my stomach can't handle it for some reason the the corn uh peppercorn gravy okay. to the lahmajun mm -hmm. to the tomahawk so, uh, everything in in totality in totality oh uh, look i'm i'm not picky i'm just that ten. kind of guy ten. so i give it a full 10 not out of 10. Either. but it's, it's out of five star <laughs> all right, so five out of five, a hundred percent, five stars. Okay, all right. So I'm gonna, and, and even if I was to be picky, I, I still would give it a five. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna be a little bit more critical. So uh, Ali, da the, Ali the, needs dawa. Ali, Ali, Ali needs. definitely needs dawa. Well, this one. <laughs> Ali needs to bring the drama. <laughs> Lahmajan was nice. Um, the meat. This was very nice. And the oil and the usually they just have like oil. You can't really eat. Mm. This one was actually very tasty. You dip the bread in it. Mm. I really liked it. The, the sauce was very nice. The mashed potato was really nice as well. I would personally give it, I think it was a very, very nice four. So you said I five, I said so. four, we'll have to be at four and a half star. Four and a half, class. I'm four happy with star. that. It's very, very nice. That's How good. was the service? I, I don't think it's going to be fair. Ah, because why? you're Ali Dawa. Of course they're going to give you great service. As soon as you walk in here, mashallah, be mashallah. Okay, they, they, but the thing is they didn't know me. That's what you think. They didn't, no, they didn't. They That's didn't. what but you we, think. They, they didn't know the cameras were there, but they might be true. <laughs> so let's, let's just, Bear that in mind, so like mm -hmm. you said as well. So how the sister served us? They turned down so the, the music, the, they did, they the did. Guy, the guy they, at the front, etc. Uh, another five stars. Nah, nah, you're going like, nice, too, I can't <laughs> say. <start, like, laughs> so nah, nah, nah. he, he was such a nice guy. He was, no, he, he was a lovely guy. They even told us, why are you taking a video of this? Why are you taking a video of that? Like, they're literally helping you do your job. Of course, of course, I, okay. I, I, I accept okay. that. Okay. But <laughs> I would personally say... <laughs> Look beyond the... Uh, the, the sister that served us was very kind, she was very, very helpful. Kind. She recommendation-wise, yeah, mm -hmm. I recommend you to get that. Mm -hmm. oh, the brother, when he greeted us, you know, catered for us, etc. So I would definitely say, Four star, the okay. very, very good service. All right, yeah, he's gonna say okay. five. So, okay, four. so that's four star for service. Four star. How was the timing? <laughs> so it came in 20 minutes, but bear in mind it's not that busy. Mm -hmm. So, to me, I would definitely give it a three star because it's not that busy. Mm -hmm. it, it was really days. busy, and it came in 20 minutes. Do you, minutes? Want, your, you want your stick to come out in five minutes? Well, you're gonna get some sort of food poisoning. Right. Being picky again, this guy is not nice. Nice. Yeah, right. yeah, right. Okay, okay. We'll, we'll give it. We'll give it a three. You said twenty like, minutes. Just be, be mindful that they had to prepare that, that, no, that no, display no. and for so time and. He always. I don't know if it's Ali Dawa who talks about um, giving people benefit of the doubt, but he doesn't. Especially in this dining to Jana episode, he doesn't give people the benefit of the doubt at all. <laughs> Why am I so passionate about this episode? Uh, because the food looks really good 
and i mean they enjoyed it i don't know why he was in a hurry to eat like 20 minutes is good enough you had time to talk it's not like you came in starving like dying of hunger or um, and like it's not a fast food chain so you have to give it better ratings i don't know for some reason i'm passionate about this restaurant so forgive me three, 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 three stars. how was the portion now bear in mind okay it's not the bigger the portion look, the look. more points we right. drop points if it's unnecessary portion. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so was that enough for three people look we were told it was enough for six people oh okay. that's not enough that's, that's enough, enough for me on only of six people. i think that is Amazing. perfect for three people mm -hmm. like yeah. you're not oh, overfilled okay. you're yes. perfect yeah? yeah for three people it's good mm -hmm. but it's a little it's, it comes to about 33 pounds per person okay so just that bit bearing that yes. bear that in mind mm -hmm. but i think the portion wise i think it's it, pertaining to that i would say a good good three and a half four star mm -hmm. what would you say uh, definitely for the portion yeah um i definitely won't say it's for six people i'll say three people yeah. perfect yeah portion. three stars for the portion guy, I was gonna say four. He's, he's making <laughs> i have to be more critical now oh, okay good critical. good good okay i would personally can we meet at three and a half okay three and a half okay we're three and a half the portion so I would price, give it three. It's uh, we won't mention the I mean, price. I don't we know how big it so it is person, actually. Ten pounds per hundred gram. So you can decide how much you want of that. But mm -hmm. I would personally say, say the tomahawk thing is more on the expensive side. It is mm -hmm. more on the expensive side. Not ex like crazy, but it's mm -hmm. just like we said about thirty-three pounds mm -hmm. per person. And I would personally say I'm going to give two two different um, mm -hmm. stars. Three and a half for standard food, okay. special food, two and a half star price. Mm -hmm. Good. Now gender points. Time for the gender po uh, points. Gender so, points. This is gender points. So just we'll just ask a few questions, shall I? So number one, is the menu fully halal sister? Like everything, there's no pork. No. Okay, so that means they have one gender point. Oh, that's tea. Point, okay. Gender point. Number two, do they serve do you serve alcohol sister? No. no. They don't serve alcohol, that's one more. I guess she's a fan. Very, no, very you have to say gender point. Gender point. point. Okay, good. Yes. Number three. Do they play music? Yes. Yes. That's one. Jahannam. Okay. Different to the people. <laughs> that's where. Zero. <laughs> sorry. Okay. That's, okay, that's no gender point. Right. Number four, do they have a prayer room? Bro, oh, they have a dedicated prayer room. They do. Yes, and bro, a dedicated. This bro, is... And this one will do as well. Now, oh, wow. do they have segregation for sisters? I, I won't say it's complete segregation, but it, it is more of a secluded place. Like, I, I, I specifically. It's not bad. It, like, yeah. If they were I think he's, yeah, I'm he's, not sure. But this is like a bit. Okay, sometimes. so we will do something. We will say. Half a point? We're half a point. We're going to have half. We'll give a gender point, but bearing in mind that if it's not busy, you can have this. If it's mm -hmm. busy, you're not going to have this option. Mm -hmm. It's not fully segregated. So mm -hmm. we would give it based on that, but it's, it's you know, mm. discretionary. So. That's it. I mean, mm -hmm. nothing else needs to be said. Awesome. Uh, I've, I've enjoyed it. Brothers and sisters, till next time, from Dining to Jannah, we're going to see you very, very soon, inshallah. If you want to be a guest, please contact me, or I'll contact you. <laughs> Can I be, Sorry. Baron, for, unless you're in the Philippines, then yes, but uh, apart from that, mm, I don't even know if he has female guests. I don't think so. Like, he will sit there, and then that person will sit there. Is that how it's happening? Oh, we will segregate ourselves and just shout, like, yo, well, but anyways <laughs> let me know what you guys thought this is like one of my favorite uh like series to react to it's very entertaining you get to see a lot of food that you don't get to see or you don't even know about um whenever we react to dining to jenna and it was interesting to see kamal salad as well on the channel i didn't even know that he was australian i've been i've been reacting to him before or sometimes we do react to him but i didn't know that i thought he was british sorry for my assumptions and my ignorance and yeah i know that i i talked a lot in this video i yapped and con uh, complained a lot but sometimes we just get fiery and we just get intense if you like this video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe i'll see you in the next video bye